Hi guys, in this video let me see the errors in measurements, sources of error in measurements. In any instrument there is always a degree of uncertainty. This resulting the error. It's never possible to measure the true value of dimensions. There is always some error. The error in the measurement is the difference between the measured value and the true value of measured dimensions. The error in the measurements may be expressed either as an absolute error or as a relative error. This absolute error classifies into two types. First one is a true absolute error. It's algebraic difference between the result of measurement and the conventional true value of the quantity. Apparent absolute error. It's an algebraic difference between one of the result of measurement and the arithmetic mean is known as apparent absolute error. Relative error. It's a quotient of absolute error and the true value of arithmetic mean for a series of measurement. This is called relative error. Let me see the type of errors in measurements. Errors classified into two major categories. First one is a static error, dynamic error. Then the static error classified into reading error, characteristic error, environmental error. This dynamic error is classified into two categories, systematic error and random error. Then this systematic error classified into calibration error, ambient error, stylus pressure error, avoidable error and instrumental loading error. These are the type of errors in measurements. Static errors. These errors results from a physical nature of various component of measuring system. This is called static error. There are three basic sources of static errors. Let me see one by one. Reading error. These reading errors occurs due to the carelessness of the operator. These do not have any direct relationship with the type of errors within the measuring system. This is happens only with carelessness of the operator. A reading errors includes Parallax error. Parallax error arises on account of pointer and scale not being in the same plane. We can eliminate this error by having the pointer and scale in the same plane. See this picture. The pointer and the scale are given here. The operator B only can take the accurate reading because he only is seeing perpendicular to the scale. Another two persons are seeing the scale from some of angle of inclination, so they cannot see, take the accurate value. See this, the person B can take the accurate value along the line, the person C can take the value as 20 point something, the person A can take the value of 17 point something. So this is called parallax error. Wrong scale reading on wrong recording of data, inaccurate estimate of average readings, in incorrect conversion of units and calculations. These all are includes in the reading error. Characteristic error. It's defined as the deviation of the output of the measuring system from the theoretical predicted performance or the nominal performance of specification. This is called characteristic error. Linearity errors, repeatability, hysteresis and characteristic errors if theoretical output is straight line, this all are comes under this error. Calibrations are also included in characteristic error. Environmental errors. These are resulting the effect of surroundings such as temperature, pressure, humidity on a measuring systems. It can be reduced by controlling the atmosphere according to the specific requirements. Thanks for watching, subscribe and share with your friends.